Good morning. I have decided to get my shit together this week, so... Let's do this thing. It is a very miserable, dark and rainy day, but I'm not letting that get me down today. This week, the best way of putting this is I'm getting my shit together. I kind of like have been coasting. I would say that's the only way to really describe it. I've been coasting through this semester of college and just kind of life in general. I've been doing everything last minute when possible and just being like, oh, I'll deal with that tomorrow or I'll do that later or I'll avoid that until absolute necessary. And I really, really haven't enjoyed that kind of mindset. It's something that I've always had, but I right now just feel like it's it's just holding me back in so, so many ways. And I want to challenge myself this week to see if I can do all of the things that the internet and philosophers and all of these smart people and whatever, what they say is, you know, doing things like drinking your water, waking up early, doing time management, all of that kind of stuff. I just kind of want to try it. I want to give it my all. I want to give it a go and I want to see how I get on with it by the end of the week. I already started off well this morning. I woke up before eight. I did a little journaling. I've drank some water. I made my bed and I got changed into kind of like comfy but not too comfy clothes that I feel like I'm doing something. So I feel like I've gotten onto a good start and I'm very happy with that. But yeah. So I thought maybe if you guys wanted to join along with me, you could, if you watch this video. This isn't a video to be like, oh my god, if you wake up at this time, shame on you. Or if you do this, shame on you. Because believe me, I do all of that too. And it's still so, so important to kind of follow your own body. If you work best at night time, then you work best at night time. Don't let the internet or anyone else tell you otherwise. I'm super excited. I hope you guys are too. Welcome to a new video. Stick around. But I've closed my laptop for the day because I have a task I would like to complete and it involves this thing. That's my wardrobe. It's where I keep all my clothes. But it is currently the biggest mess ever. If you guys are regular watchers, this happens all the time. I <laughs> always get my wardrobe messy. I'm doing a little clean of it now, folding up my clothes properly, just giving it a bit of a freshen up because I have knitwear for winter that I want to put in. And yeah, that is my last big task for the day. Woo!
Good morning, everyone. It is Tuesday morning and it is quarter past 11. I woke up this morning to my lovely period. Thank you, Mother Nature. And I stayed at home from college from the day because for me personally, I don't know about you guys, but my period has gotten worse with age, especially the first day. I get really, really nauseous. I don't feel good at all. I think lots of us can relate to that. Luckily, I'm definitely very blessed with my period. Some people get it so bad. My heart goes out to you. But yeah, I just kind of needed to be in my comfy clothes today. Down below, I'm wearing the comfiest tracks and bottoms I own. Yay! So I'm at home, but I have to join a call soon to be a part of one of my classes with my group for our final year project. Yes, the girl bossing continues. I woke up this morning at half seven, like naturally myself anyway, and I just kind of decided to stay awake instead of like rolling over for another like half an hour. So that was good. And I had a bit of a slower start to my morning, but I'm feeling really good and very positive right now. I have a bit of work to do today at my laptop. So I've got college work to do and I've got like campaign work that I would like to do as well. So yeah, it's kind of all going on. But one of the things I wanted to try today um, and it kind of just came to me like a few minutes ago. I wanted to put on a very light amount of makeup today, put on like a nice jumper. I've got some jewelry on so that I feel a bit more put together. This is like one of those technique or tactic or tip, if you will, that I've seen on the internet where people say, especially if you're working from home, etc., try to put on a little bit of makeup or something that makes you feel a bit more put together and that it makes you more productive. So I wanted to put that to the test and I am already feeling like, oh, I can get so much done today or there's just something that especially since my work involves like camera it feels nice to just feel a bit more put together so that's another tip i'm trying this week when i'm at home and i feel like it's working i didn't put on any mascara because i wanted it to still be very natural makeup but i'm very happy with how it turned out tuesday we're off to a good start i'm feeling good i didn't let the fact that i woke up not feeling well kind of ruin my day. I'm still getting on with it, but I'm being gentle and kind to myself, which I love. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna get some work done, and we'll chat later. Hello everyone. It is now currently seven minutes past two and I had, Elton's at the door, one sec. <laughs> Hello, welcome back. How was your trip outside? Huh? What's going on? What's happening? You look very handsome. Anywho, I just had my class online there, which was good, but I'm currently getting myself some lunch. Kind of a fancy lunch, I'm treating myself right now. I just put a chicken breast in the oven, but I have balsamic vinegar on it and oh, I forget the name. Honey and Dijon mustard and basil, a bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, and there was a bag of cheese in the fridge. And I have no idea what cheese it is, but I bought that on top. And I'm going to put some rice on. So yeah, I don't even know if all these flavours go together, but look. It's all a bit of fun and games at the end of the day. I'm going over to Owen's in a little bit, so I'm gonna get some more work done before I go. And then I'm gonna come home later, have a nice calm evening, get some sleep, get up early in the morning, go to college, all that stuff. And anyway, love you lots. Chat in a bit. Hey Mrs. Claus, this one's for you. Tell me, sweet mama, what's a guy to do? I'm tired of pretending it's just who I am. Come on, Mrs. Claus, let me be your man. I'll quit shaving, wear a cap on my head. By matching robes all shiny and red. I'm begging you, please, I'll do all that I can. Come on, Mrs. Claus, let me be your man. For all those toys You've always been the one for me My beautiful angel on top of the tree 
Christmas Eve if you're feeling alone. Go right ahead and pick up the phone. Give me a call, I'll come quick as I can. Oh, come on, Mrs. Claus, let me be your man. It is now Friday, but it's not just any Friday. It's Owen's birthday today. So I am literally rushing out the door to go grab him a birthday card and go over to his and then we're going out for dinner tonight. So I'm super, 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 super excited about it. And yeah, I love people's birthdays. I love birthdays in general. So anyway, one of the days this week, my mom picked me up from college and I went into Penny's. I don't go into pennies too much, but every now and again, you just kind of need a top up of things. So I got these very, very cute red gingham PJs. I think they're like so subtly Christmassy and I don't know, this gives me like such Scandy girl vibes like Matilda Jerf would wear these type of things and I just I love them They're super soft really like them so happy. I got another pair of PJs, which I think I'm gonna take to Owens this evening These are them it's shorts and a long sleeve top. I know it's winter, but I really prefer having my legs like out when I'm at home because I just find they get itchy and like claustrophobic sometimes. And I just need to let them breathe, if that makes sense to anybody. But it's this really, really, really soft fabric. They look so cozy, but cute at the same time, which we love. I also got a new pair of slippers. How cute are these? I got a little hair towel. I love these, they're very convenient and I'm always using them. And then I just got a little pair of underwear, a little pack. They're all the little bits I got in pennies. Super happy with them, but I got to go now. I'm super excited for a chill weekend. I feel pretty grateful for this week and I hope you guys had a good week in some shape or form as well. We have up and down days, but in general, we pulled through this week and I'm very proud. So maybe we'll keep this up next week. I love you all so, so much and I will see you soon. Bye.